Welcome to Indian Mastermind, YouTube's hot topics. Always find more. IMM YouTube channel. Have you ever wondered whether the brains of men and women are fundamentally different? This question has sparked numerous debates in the field of neuroscience. And today, we delve into the heart of this intriguing topic. Research has shown that there are indeed some structural and functional differences between the brains of males and females. For instance, men tend to have a slightly larger overall brain volume on average, while women have a higher percentage of grey matter. But before jumping to conclusions, hold your horses. These differences don't suggest superiority or inferiority of one gender over the other. They are but a piece of the puzzle, a fragment of the story we are about to unfold. A recent study by Stanford University has thrown more light onto this complex issue. The team employed artificial intelligence to generate brain scans, revealing that males and females are indeed wired differently. Cognitive ability contrasts were also observed. But again, these findings don't suggest that one gender is superior to the other. Studies have shown that these structural differences might lead to variations in how males and females process information and perceive the world. Males may excel in certain spatial tasks, while females may perform better in verbal tasks. However, it's crucial to remember that these differences are not absolute and there is significant overlap between the sexes. The takeaway here is that individual differences within each gender are far more significant than differences between genders on average. It's not just about the biology, social and environmental factors also play a crucial role in shaping brain development and behavior. In a nutshell, while there are differences between male and female brains, it's important to approach this topic with caution. Oversimplification and generalization can lead to misconceptions and biases. The human brain is a complex organ and its functioning is influenced by a multitude of factors including gender but not limited to it. The Stanford University study is a step forward in our understanding of this complexity but the journey of discovery is far from over. So, the next time you come across the age-old debate of men are from Mars, women are from Venus. Remember we are all unique and our brains are as diverse as the stars in the universe 